Okay, here we are for the unboxing this time of a more of a video game type of lava lamp. It, it looks pretty cool because it's green. I'm a very good, big fan of the green and blue colors in red, but I have the most lava lamps that I have are green. Okay, so right here we have this. It's called, so I don't get it wrong, 8-bit graphics. So it's supposed to like emulate one of those Nintendo games or something. Well, just the base, not the actual lava, which is going to be green. Okay. Flow, green lava lamp, and blue liquid. Doesn't You know how the, the, the liquid's very light on here, so you might not see the liquid as blue, but whatever. So let's take a look. Okay. Now, this was um, a shipping item. I've never had any problems with having a lava lamp ship, and their customer service is nothing but fantastic. I remember I, they gave me a bad lava lamp, lamp bulb once and they sh sent me another one right away. They just asked me to take a picture of the bulb or something. I took a picture of it. So here we go. We got this, directions. You don't need to read that unless there's something wrong with your head and you can't comprehend it. And <laughs> look at this. This is more just garbage. And here's the um, base that comes out of the lava lamp. I've done so many of these unboxings now. I don't think anyone's un unboxed more Spencer's lamps than I have. Okay. Um, it reminds me of Super Mario a lot. I don't know why they didn't just let them put Super Mario on it. I'm sure they, would, they wouldn't have cared. It's not like they were going to make a ton of money off of it. But here it is right here. Um, is the is the lamp base. Forgive me if the light doesn't go on it. I don't have pr pr professional lighting and I'm not going to do it. I think it's pretty neat. It's pretty neat. Uh-oh, it's a little dented. Oh, no. It's a little de tiny dent over here. That's not going to make a big deal anyways. Nobody will be able to see it. Um, so here's the um, cap. Take a look at that. Um, lucky that dent went right back into place. Um, here's the cap. Okay. Now you're going to see the bulb. So this is a 40 watt bulb, I believe. Yeah, all these, I should know by now after I have had so many of them. I had over a dozen now. Not that it work. yeah, pretty much a dozen that are work. over a dozen lava lamps that run every night at the same time. 40 watt bulb. See, you put it in there, it's pretty much common sense. You twist it. Don't give it too much force, because these things can break. Light bulbs can be deadly, um, I guess, if you don't... Yeah, pretty much they actually... Never mind, I guess they can be if you don't do it right. All right, won't go anymore. Tightened in. Got that. Okay, what are we missing? Well, first, got to take off the stupid ties that they put for the plug. I hate this. I don't know whose idea it was to put all these ties on here. They could have just... They could have just did this and put the plastic over it. But, whatever. So, we're going to take out the main attraction now. Got this. Alright. Don't pick it up by the cap. Because if you damage the cap, you're screwed. Okay. Here we go. Has that thing on the top right here. Your lava lamp will take two to three hours to reach optimal flow and color. Once the your lamp heats up, do not move or shake the lamp. Um, look how though, you look at this blue and compare it to the box, it doesn't look anything like this. So just expect that. I, I, I've learned that, that most lamps do not look like the box at all. So you have to just do it yourself kind of thing. Make sure you take this off before you start anything. Um, you're going to put this inside of there. Um, see right there. You're going to put the cap. You don't need this to operate the lava lamp, but it'll look like shit looking at the cap the whole time. So put the cap on it. Voila. So, I'll take um, I'll take the camera and I'll give it a little view myself so you can look at it. Because it's not exactly great the way it is, but... Here we go, see? You can see all the graphics on the bottom. Stuff like that. Um, I don't know what took them so long to make a lava lamp like this, especially with all the video games out there. You thought they, thought they would have did it sooner. Um, and then you got this. Alright, bye-bye.